Good morning or good afternoon and welcome to day four of our 21 days of prayer. It's Monday the 4th of March. My name's Stuart along with my wife Julie. I'm one of the pastors at our South location. I just want to take a few moments to set us up to pray for South. The writer to the Hebrews said this, let us draw near to God with a sincere heart and with full assurance that faith brings, having our hearts sprinkled to cleanse us from a guilty conscience and having our bodies washed with pure water, let us hold unswervingly to the hope we profess, for he who promised is faithful. And let us consider how we may spur one another on toward love and good deeds, not giving up meeting together, as some are in the habit of doing, but encouraging one another, and all the more as you see the day approaching. Three simple let us moments that are how we connect with one another and build the church. Number one, let us draw near to God. He has got to be the centre of our lives, both individually and collectively. We don't just draw near to draw near to each other when we get together at church. We draw near to draw near collectively to God. The second thing the writer to the Hebrew tells us to do is to hold unswervingly to the hope we profess. Everyone needs hope. Hope is the game changer. That chance that things will be better, that things will be different. But a hope in Jesus that is steadfast and certain, immobile, immovable, because it is based on the promises of God, that hope we hold on to. And the third let us, he splits into three, so humor me here. Number one, let us spur one another on. Take responsibility for each other, provoking each other to love and to serve well. Second let us in this third parter, not give up meeting together. Keep on turning up to church. Church is the greatest start to every week of our lives. Commit yourself to it in this season. And thirdly, in the three-parter, let us encourage one another. Literally, pour courage into each other. When we gather, whether it's our South, Central, North, Chester, Sheffield, Cardiff, Geneva, wherever we gather, whatever the campus or location we're responsible for encouraging each other and bringing life four quick points to pray for for our south location number one we're looking for a new venue so that the facilities give us the chance to grow and expand the way we know god wants us to secondly for the rhythm of weekly new people and salvations and that comes because it's driven by the third and fourth thing number three the confidence and boldness to bring people to church. We want to pray that into each and every one of you and each and every one of us. And finally, we're praying for growth in the number of volunteers. Would you join us in praying for those things today, setting us together to believe and see increase, not just in our South location, but in every place where Audacious is. God bless you. Have a brilliant day.